The UW Formula SAE team is a multidisciplinary student group using their machine shop in the mechanical engineering building to manufacture two race cars for competition. So right now we are almost at the very end of manufacturing. So everyone's pushing really hard to get their parts done and ready to put on the car. We have our design quarter, which is autumn quarter, our manufacturing quarter, which is winter quarter, and then we assemble the car and testing and tuning is spring quarter. And then our fourth quarter is competition. We compete in two competitions each year. Uh, the first of which is in Lincoln, Nebraska. Um, there's nothing there but an airport, in my opinion. But uh, in Lincoln, Nebraska, the competition uh, is against approaching 190 to 100 other teams from mostly only across the United States. Um, and so it's our quote unquote national competition. Um, and then we go to Hockenheim, Germany. There's a lot of recruiters at competition. Uh, last year, we had the director of powertrain development for Tesla asking us about the electric powertrain on our car. Because if you can speak eloquently and clearly about why you made a certain design decision versus another design decision and back that up with engineering data, that's exactly what employers want to hear. I think Formula SAE is a huge contributor to being able to get a job out of college, especially at a really cool company. There's lots of universities that kick out a lot of students that are intelligent, and um, most students don't have hundreds of hours in the machine shop or um, have built you know, cars in high vibration environments or have used these big pieces of software that every industrial company does use. Essentially, we run as a small to medium-sized business. Managing this many students means horizontal integration in a way that breaks down the daunting process into manageable components. We have a fairly decentralized way of building the car. So each system is broken up into its own tech team. So you have your chassis team, you have your drivetrain team, you have your suspension team, you have your aerodynamics team, etc. We like to do it this way, this decentralized way, because it allows our teammates to take responsibility and own their project. It allows them to actually, at the end of the year, have something that they said, I made, I designed this, I made it, and I tested it. But then those components all come together to form the car. Formula SAE gives students an escape from academic monotony and provides them with a place to get their hands dirty. And they provide a base that you really need of um, working out the problems on paper, doing all those math. Um, but frankly, then we come here. Here there's a lot of real world applications in software and machining. Um, and then there there's a lot more kind of um, uh, theoretical, mathematical side of things. The hands-on um, and the kind of real world, quote unquote, uh, is the most helpful just because even at like base level, just because it differentiates you. You get to build stuff, you get to wire things, you get to drive a race car. I was just doing the same old school thing, going to class, doing my homework, you know, and it just wasn't enough. And the ability to be able to take, again, what I learned in the classroom and apply it to something that's real, that's tangible, and you know, go zero to 60 in three seconds is awesome. <laughs>